So, um, if you're here, you're probably only here for one reason. Um, you're here to find out which 3x3 three three is best for its price. I have Speed Cube Shop and the Cubicle open. We're going to take it to WCA 3x3 three three Puzzles. And, uh, let's go. So, obviously, first we get to start off at the low price range, with the budget cubes. Um, I am currently at summer camp by the time you see me upload this video. I'm going to schedule it, and whoa, the little magic's on sale for $2.99. Are you kidding me? Jesus Christ, okay. Alright, so, at Speed Cube Shop for 3x3, the lowest costing 3x3 is currently the sale W, which is also discounted for a dollar and ninety. How can you charge this price for a 3x3? What the heck? My gosh, that's amazing. Okay. So, at the cubicle, the cheapest non-discounted cube is the Kung Fu Leo Ren, the Cyclone Boys Mini 3x3. And the MF3, the and the MF3S, the Mofeng Jiaoshi Mini, a bunch of mini cubes that I don't want to buy. The Sail, the Warrior W, Shangshao Gem, the Legend 3x3, the Tank, the Guanlong, 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 <laughs> the Guanlong, 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 the Black Kirin, the Aurora, Meilong, the Sail W, and then that's where we go to the higher price range. So the best one I would recommend is the Little Magic. The Sail W, of course. The MFDRS 2, not the MFDRS. Um, what else? Not the Feiwu. Uh, the Warrior W is pretty good. And the Meilong, I heard, was pretty good. But let's check that on SpeedTube Shop. Definitely get the Sail W, especially at a dollar, because that's a really good, that's a really good price. The Black Kirin V2, two bucks, that's a really good price too. The Guanlong and the Big Sail, or no, this is just the normal Sail. These two are these the the sale specifically has a good reputation for a good cube for modding if you want to do modding. Guanlong is pretty nice for a really cheap price. Warrior W, uh, Chi cube. It's really controllable and it's really cheap. Uh, let's go to the next page. The MF3S is really good. Um, the Guanlong Plus is fine. The Black Kirin was okay. Um, Guanlong. Buy the Yushin Little Magic, MFDRS, or the Meilong. Honestly, those are the only really, really, really good budget cubes. Next, we're going to the medium price range. So this is where all of your best selling is going to be, obviously. Okay, so here we have some expensive things like the GTS 3. GTS 2, that's where we're starting off. The Mo Yue Long GTS 2 is $19.99 non-magnetic the magnetic version is like twenty dollars or something twenty five dollars um but this is one of the greatest cubes ever like greatest flagship puzzles out there but one of the greatest you should get the like nova or the cubicle custom or the angstrom or something whatever you should get the um nova slash cosmic for sweet cube shop or the cubicle custom slash pro shop version because Cubicle does set up the GTS 2 really well. Uh, Speed Cube Shop also does a really good job with their custom or their custom cubes, which is the Supernova and Cosmic. They do a really good job with the GTS 2. For the GTS 2, I'm going to have to say go to the Cubicle if you want a premium version, like Labs, Pro Shop. Go to the Cubicle. They do um, GTS 2s better than Speed Cube Shop does. But if you just want it stock, it's really nice. It's a good cube. Uh... What's next? Let's see. For mid price range, the YJMGC isn't a bad option. The Huang Lung M isn't a bad option. The Valk 3M, probably the best mid range puzzle you can buy. Um, it's basically it's the same performance wise as the GTS2. It's just a lot more controllable. It's right here. It's just a lot more controllable. Um. The magnets are obviously going to be a lot lighter. Um, I personally, I don't have a normal Volk 3. I have Volk Power, and I can't really recommend that because it's really selective to only a few people who will actually like it. Listen to my Volk Power M. Like, just I'm just going to play it right next to my mic ASMR time. Yeah, it's really loud. 
Valk 3, the Valk 3 is probably one of the best puzzles for this price range. So get the Valk 3 if you really want a good mid-range puzzle. Uh, what else? Mm. The GAN 306R is not that good because it's not magnetized, but you can magnetize it yourself and it's like 20 something bucks. And it's pretty much the X except with um, non-changeable magnets. Kylan V2M, solid, probably the best budget cube on the market, so you should get that one. Uh, so next we're going to the more flagship side of things. Uh, this is probably if you have the unlimited, unlimited budgets, highest price. This is where all your flagship cubes are going to be. Uh, first thing I see is the G uh, Cubicle Angstrom, or Cubicle Custom GTS 3, $50. I know the GAN Air goes for higher. I really want the Valk Power in its red limited edition. I don't know if it still has primary internals. If it does, it's probably a deal breaker. Um, this is where you're going to find stuff like the GTS 2M, Cubicle Labs version, the Waylong WR, the Valk Power, GAN Air. This is where all the GANs puzzles are, honestly. Like, all of the top-selling things. So, you can get a Mystic Cube, a WRM, Angstrom, Cubicle Custom GTS 2, Angstrom, and... Mystic GTS 3. Here's all of your flagship puzzles. Let's check it out on Speedkeep Shop. So, obviously, they're going to have their Supernova. Oops. Obviously, they're going to have their Supernova cubes on top because those things are pretty expensive. Cosmic MF3 RS2M is actually a really nice option. Um, It's pretty cheap for as far as Cosmic cubes go. The GTS 2 is also a really nice Cosmic cube. Uh, Let's find a GAN Air. Let's find the Gans Air. The Gan, the Cosmic Gan Air SM is literally almost 80 bucks, but it's top of the line, top of the line stuff, dude. The Gan 354 is also a good option if you have smaller hands. The SM is older cube, but it's still really nice to try out. Uh, you can get a GTS 3M for 40 bucks. Those are some of the best cubes you can buy for that price point. Um, so I guess that's all, question mark. So thank you guys for joining me today in this video. I am at summer camp. I scheduled this upload just so you guys know. I'm at summer camp. I scheduled this upload. Make you make sure you check out the cubicle and make sure you check out the speed cube shop. I will leave the link to both of them down in the description below. Thank you guys so much for watching. Subscribe, like the video, and I'll see you next time.